Hi, welcome to DailyNet. This time, the news about the Chinese entertainment scene will begin with Zhang Jahan's comeback to the world of entertainment via his concert in Thailand. Gaining popularity after the drama Word of Honor, Zhang Jahan's career as a Chinese actor and singer came to an end as he was promptly removed from the Chinese entertainment industry owing to accusations of being pro-Japanese. Working away from his homeland on his musical comeback, the 32-year-old recently fulfilled an old dream of holding his own concert in Bangkok, where he hypnotized the audience with costume changes reflecting the concert's four thematic concepts, namely setting sail, choices, storm, and rebirth. Zhang Jahan impressed listeners during the Zhang Jahan 2023 concert Primordial Theater by singing songs such as Magnificent Life and Stars Light You Up while dressed all in black and accompanied by a gorgeous blue fur model. Gran Yi Music is the promoter of the event, which takes place from May 10 to 11. He is reportedly involved in several parts of the concert, including choreography, stage design, and overall flow, an old desire that he expresses as important to his heart. As the audience joined in on the chorus of Stars Light You Up near the end, he thanked his adoring fans for their friendship and support throughout his journey, vowing to deliver them more amazing work. A pastel-themed cake was wheeled in to commemorate the singer's 32nd birthday, while Zhang Jahan sweetly granted his birthday wish to all present, hoping that their individual goals may all come true, and voiced his other hope that they be bestowed with good health, safety, and smoothness. More information on the drama The Golden Hairpin, which may have found a resolution as a result of the scandal perpetrated by the main character, Wu Yifan. The Golden Hairpin is a Chinese drama starring actress Yang Zha and actor Wu Yifan. However, due to the emergence of the Wu Yifan scandal, the broadcast of the drama was suspended. The Golden Hairpin would have launched this summer if Wu Yifan hadn't been involved in a scandal. The drama has finished eight months of filming with a total budget of 400 million yuan, and if it is not televised, the production company would incur significant losses. Previously, there were reports that Wu Yifan will be replaced by AI to get him out of the drama, but no firm decision has been made. Lin Gungxin was rumored to be taking his place last year. The reports have recently resurfaced, stating that the actor has agreed to appear in the production. Lin Gengshin was first thought to be hesitant to take on the post. He felt that the position was contaminated by the uncovering of the Wu Yifan controversy. However, the drama's producers, Tencent Video, Zinli TV, and Phoenix United Picture appear to have persuaded Lin Gengshin by offering two other projects as a bargain. Yangza followers are overjoyed with the progress of the drama The Golden Hairpin since they can watch favorite actress in action on the screen right away. The Golden Hairpin, on the other hand, is about a detective who collaborates with a royal to solve the mystery of a serial killer. Aside from Yangza, this drama will also include Zhuan Yan, Shane Jiyuan, Xiao Wei, Sui Junbo, and others. Next, according to viral fan cams, the historical drama The Story of Hua Ji now officially stars Zhang Jingyi and Hu Yithian. Not only the two of them, but also Liu Yuxiao, who appeared in the fan cam for the drama. The female lead in this drama has always been in the hands of Zhang Jingyi, according to the news. However, the male lead was earlier reported to have numerous names, including Zhang Binbin, Lin Yi, and Hu Yithian, who will now officially cast the drama. This drama will apparently be directed by Zhu Yibin, who is recognized for a number of significant and popular projects including Noble Aspirations, Ashes of Love, Eternal Love of Dream, The Long Ballad, The Blue Whisper, and most recently The Starry Love. Hei Fong, who wrote the script for the drama Till the End of the Moon, will also work on this project. With the previous project's successful pairing of director and writer, many Chinese drama fans are excited for more with this drama production. The Story of Hua Ji is a historical romance genre drama based on Kong Liu's web novel Shi Hua Ji. Tells the story of a woman named Hua Ji Yuan, who thought she could become the daughter of the most qualified family and enjoy a stable life, but when the Hua family was near to collapse, she had to demonstrate her superiority in order to protect this vulnerable family. Then there's the disturbing news of Yang Zha and Xu Kai fans abusing each other online over their upcoming drama. In early June, popular Chinese artists Yang Zha and Xu Kai will begin filming their new modern romance story of joy. Although this drama was expected to be a modernized version of the story of Minglin, there was a lot of backlash from fans on both sides as soon as the news broke. This is because Xu Kai's followers are disappointed that this drama would focus more on female characters. On the other hand, Yang Zha's admirers chastised Xu Kai for being too good at making news. 
Recently, the behind-the-scenes team list of the event was revealed, in which Tian Yu, who previously worked on the dramas I Don't Want to Be Friends With You and Memory of Encaustic Tile, will direct this drama. Then there's scriptwriter Li Jingling, who wrote the dramas The Blue Whisper and Unchained Love. Story of Joy is an adaptation of Yisha's novel stories of Mai Chung Huan. She is well known for her idea works with numerous descriptions and she has a huge number of devoted followers. However, with the selection of Li Jingling to rewrite the screenplay of stories of Mai Chung Huan, many netizens are concerned that the classic old issue would re-emerge because the author is known for her classic magical modifications, and many are pessimistic about this drama. Furthermore, despite the fact that Yang Zha and Xu Kai were both incredibly popular actors, they had no CP when they stood together. Many Chinese netizens are concerned that the drama's sweetness will be insufficient and that there will be a competition for positions outside of the game. Next, when many people think of Wu Jinyan, they think of her classic drama story of Yan Shi Palace. The drama was famous at the time, and she took advantage of the opportunity, appearing in The Legend of Hao Lan, Knock on the Happiness Door, and other dramas. She had collaborated with Nie Yuan multiple times. However, the word-of-mouth quality of the play is extremely ordinary, seldom exceeding five points. Although Wu Jinyan's fighting youth with powerful actor Yin Tao is very popular, her appearance is deemed to be weak among the other cast members. Her acting abilities have been critiqued by viewers, and her career has suffered at Waterloo. Wu Jinyan has returned to acting in dramas such as Legacy and Royal Feast in the past year, but these two dramas have yet to break out of the circle. Nonetheless, her influence in the circle maintained, and her acting continued to garner a lot of attention. Viewers who are familiar with her work will notice that Wu Jinyan's works in the last two years have been nearly identical, continuing the cycle of showing two dramas each year. She recently received a casting call for a new drama. Marriage of the D Daughter is the title of the drama, which is set in ancient times. Marriage of the D Daughter appears to be a revenge novel based on the plot. The plot revolves around Fang Fei, the Shui family's daughter, who has a difficult existence and is murdered by the princess and the champion's husband. Following her death, she is unexpectedly resurrected as Jiangli, the second daughter of the Jiang family, kicking off the saga of a vast revenge scheme. According to reputable sources, the principal actress linked with the drama is now just Wu Jinyan. And this time, she'll almost certainly become popular again as the main character in this cool novel. This drama's subject matter has been popular for a long time before it aired, and many novel enthusiasts can't wait for it to begin broadcasting. Thank you for watching, please leave your thoughts in the comments section and see you in the next video.